Hey everyone and welcome back to my channel. My name is Sam. If you're new here, welcome. And if you're returning, welcome back. I was on kind of a crazy hiatus with the new school here starting and just the hustle and bustle of all of that. And now I am back and I'm super excited to share with you this quick comparison between the rough and tumble extra large hobo and the large hobo. This one is a plain front, this one is an open pocket, but that's not going to affect the quality of this comparison because I just wanna show you the sheer volume that these two bags can hold and then show you a quick on the body, how they look. For reference, I am like five, four and three quarters, we'll say five, five. And I weigh about 135 pounds, so that's just like quick body reference, height, whatever. Let's do this. Okay, so the best way that I thought to show you the volume that these two bags can handle was by just using some standard bath towels because everybody has some sort of standard bath towel and felt like it was a good point of reference. So this is the extra large plain front hobo and rolled up it can hold, I'm gonna speed this up. Four standard size bath towels, which is quite a lot. Like that's a pretty big bag. So now I'm gonna bring over the large hobo and see how many can fit in it. So here is my large hobo. Like I said, this is an open pocket hobo, but it's not going to affect the interior volume at all. So I'm gonna speed this up too. So as you can see, the large can fit three bath towels, but there is no room on top. I felt like the extra large had a slight bit of room on top, and this bad boy is packed full with three bath towels in it. Now I just kind of wanted to show you what these two bags looked like laid on top of each other. As you can see, you do get about an inch of space on top, and then you also get about, mm, I'd say two inches on the side. So now I'm just gonna do a quick on the body of both bags carried all three ways so you can get a good idea of what they look like and find the perfect size for you. Okay, so there you have it. I hope that that helped. I hope that gave you a good idea of the volume that these two different bags can hold and what they look like on the body. I know for me, I am always looking at all the comparison and review videos. So if this helped you decide, drop it down below. If you haven't already, go find me over on Instagram and I will see you next time. Bye guys.